booked a ticket to go to Michigan. <laughs> I'm so excited. I didn't think this was going to be a possibility. Um, me being able to go see UMich and see the law school and visit Ann Arbor. And I just found cheap flights. So I am going and I've booked my Airbnb and I want to take you guys with me. Okay, so I am currently planning for a Michigan trip. I'm so excited. I'm literally not even going to be there for like two days. I'm there for like a day and a half. But I'm so excited. I'm about to watch the A to Z um, Ann Arbor episode to see like what I should do while I'm there. And I will keep you guys updated on what I'm planning to do. And now how, how would you describe Ann Arbor now? So Ann Arbor is one of the most sophisticated, erudite, amazing, energetic places I have ever been. I made my schedule for Michigan, but I'm doing so much. Um, I decided to take the next day off of work after that because I have the LSAT the day after that. And then a wedding the day after that. So it's, we're vibing, we're doing something. Okay, so I have it laid out by the two days that I'm gonna be there. I listened to the Ann Arbor A to Z episode and decided to check out a Literati and blank slate via dean z her recommendations and then the admissions offered like five different coffee spots um to check out so i'm gonna check out sweetwater and comet comet coffee which was also a recommendation from a to z but this is day one i'm so excited i'm gonna do the mural walk it shouldn't take too long i'm just so excited for this and I'm a brewery gal, so I've got to check out one of the local breweries while we're there. Yeah, so I'm very, very excited. I'm going to check out Michigan Stadium. Hopefully it's open. I have a good feeling about this visit. Okay, so a whole roller coaster of events just happened. I had planned to tour Michigan on the 7th, but they emailed me while I was at lunch with a friend and they were like, you have to cancel this tour. And I was like, Okay, but I've already booked a flight and lodging and I'm there the 6th and 7th. Is there any way to do a self-guided tour? And they were like trying to get me to do a morning tour on the 6th and I was like, my flight doesn't land until 1 and they have an admissions counselor meeting me after I get to Ann Arbor and they're gonna take me on like a walk and talk tour personally. And that is so sweet. And it was a real roller coaster <laughs> for a second there, but I'm actually even more excited now because I was gonna meet with an admissions officer before the tour, and now it kind of feels like there's less pressure and it's a, a walk and talk. for my Michigan trip and I have created my questions for the person I'm going on a tour with and I'm so excited so I will see you guys at the airport. That should put us in Ann Arbor off team fit. here jeffrey's hall is literally behind me i'm gonna go into the bathroom and touch up my makeup and hair and try to get some footage for you guys after the tour because i don't want to be rude <laughs>
I have been going since 7 o'clock this morning. It is now 7 something at night and I'm exhausted, but the day was amazing. But the tour was great. Campus was beautiful. I learned a lot of cool history about Michigan. Um, but after the tour, I went to the M Den. So I'm first gen, for those of you who don't know, and a part of my mom and I's undergrad tradition was to buy a shirt from every college that I visited just for posterity's sake. And I'm gonna make a blanket with all these shirts. I'm very excited. It's gonna kind of document my journey. And went to Jolly Pumpkin for dinner. Had a great strawberry lime sour. Um, then I walked to my Airbnb. It was a 25 minute walk. There are so many cool beer gardens and event spaces, events happening. There are like little libraries all over the place. Um, just a very warm, welcoming place to be. I'm hoping good results for Michigan during my cycle, but we'll see. And I will update you guys tomorrow on what the happenings are. Right now, I'm gonna go chuck some water because I've had hardly any today, so good night. Good morning, it is day two in Ann Arbor. I am going to get ready and then take you guys along with me for the day, so. Okay, I just had my coffee at Comic Coffee. It was great. I'm headed to Michigan Stadium. Let's hope I can get in. I will keep you guys updated. Okay, so it was a no-go at Michigan Stadium, but it was nice to walk here. But never hurts to ask. Um, I did get to see like the outside of it. The entrance is really pretty and <laughs> It's massive. It's absolutely massive. I can just mural walk is next, so let's go. Okay, I leave Ann Arbor in about two hours, so. I'm going to go check out uh, the grotto, which has some beer from home, and have a, a cold one. And then go back to the transportation center, the transit center, and head home. room in the house right now and we can't open any windows because of the air quality currently but that was my Michigan vlog I really hope you enjoyed it um the vibe of Ann Arbor I gotta give it like a 10 out of 10 Michigan a 10 out of 10 I fell in love yeah that's my thoughts on Michigan and I enjoyed my time there so thanks for tuning in and hope to see you on the next one bye oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh.